Morning, it's Saturday, April 6th. I am off to my uh, lacrosse game, third of the year. Break out the uh, rosary beads, his first game. I'm a first year official, my third game. The blind leading the blind, so to speak. But uh, I'm sure we'll be all right. But I had a great time last night at the Sox game. I wanna thank my uh, neighbors, TK and Janet, uh, for the tickets, and uh, it was brutally cold out there. We ended up uh, leaving about the fifth inning and it was about 30, hovering between 32 and 35. So we left and we uh, came back to the hood, had some drinks at a local bar and some appetizers and uh, just uh, ended up watching the game, the end of the game at the bar. So it was fun, but uh, I am not a fan of cold weather, uh, especially at baseball games. And I, I just hate being cold. Um, I probably won't go to a game until it probably hits 70 uh, from now on, So, uh, which hopefully is very soon. The seats were great though, we were right behind home plate, probably uh, maybe 20 rows up, something like that. But I forgot last night to say uh, thank you for watching uh, the video from the day before. So uh, again, thank you for that, thank you for uh, watching, liking, subscribing, all that good stuff. We are off to Papa Do's, one of our favorite Cajun type places. Going to uh, dinner with my sister-in-law, Sexy Alexi, and Frank, my brother-in-law, and uh, off to the bank. I hate going to the bank. I just wish we can use a debit card everywhere, but sometimes you do have to bring, bring cash, but I'm just, I'm not a fan of carrying a lot of cash on you. But today I had a pretty good game. Uh, my uh, lacrosse game turned out better than I thought. My uh, partner, who was his first game, he did pretty good, and uh, I'm getting better. So uh, together we were... Uh, enough to be dangerous out there. In football and in lacrosse we have pregame and uh, we always spend a few minutes talking about overtime just going over the rules and what we do and what have you and sure enough his first game my third game we have overtime but uh, my legs are killing me you just you just run it's all you do is run up and down the field 70 yards you can go it's basically 70 yards back and forth uh, from the goal line to the 30 yard line on the uh, other side of the field. I'm in pretty decent shape but this is going to be make me in really good shape. Yo, 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 I'm making paper. <laughs> Say cheese! <laughs> you don't look like my parole officer. Is you no. <laughs> but you'll be on YouTube, don't worry. <laughs>
nice. Thank you Thanks for your time. All right. Thanks for coming out. All right. I want to see that. On uh, what, is it, what did you get? I got the special that was on the menu. Scallops? Shrimp? Pasta? What did you get, Lex? And I got, what did I get? Oh, bahi and shrimp. Looks good. This is what a dog looks like when he's afraid of lightning and thunder. He shakes like crazy. And he never sits by me. But now it's thunder and lightning out, and guess where he's at? Right next to me. He's doing this. <laughs> like he, he, he does that, he like huffs and puffs and then he holds his breath when he hears a, hears a thunder and a, or a lightning. When he hears thunder, then he holds his breath, then he starts doing that again. That dog is crazy. This dog needs a drop of breath mint like Pronto. What up, yo? It's Sunday. 18, Just chilling out here on the couch and putting some uh, study time in with the uh, lacrosse rule book. And taking some notes. Gonna do a Google Hangout later on in the week with uh, my friend Bobo. Yeah, you gotta put time in if you wanna be a sports official, whether it's football or, or lacrosse. So that's what I'm doing now. A uh, half hour every day goes a long way. Had a really uh, fun time last night. We went to this place called Papa Do. It's a uh, Cajun type restaurant, seafood, uh, Cajun type food. But what was really interesting was um, there was a group of uh, eight or nine people at our next table, and they they all ordered. They ordered, but they all got their own individual check. And I think they stiffed the uh, waiter. They didn't tip them at all. He looked really upset. And uh, as I'm really, uh, I'm really against people that. Don't tip. That's total bullshit. You know these uh, these uh, people that work in these restaurants and this one in particular. I think they they make about four dollars and ninety five cents, and they live off the tips. So, and I know this kid was working his his ass off, um, and he was a really really good waiter. He definitely deserves at least twenty percent. We tipped him a little more, uh, but that's real. It's really uh, pimpy not to uh, you know just to pay your bill and not leave them anything. So. That was kind of the downside of the night, but hey, overall it was real fun. I uh, had, had a good night. And now, I'm watching the White Sox. 2-2 two -two against Seattle, bottom of the fourth. So uh, trying to uh, get a uh, series win here today. We uh, lost Friday night, won yesterday. I went to the game Friday night, froze my ass off. And today trying to uh, get the series win. I've come to the conclusion that in life, sometimes people are never happy. Uh, for instance, last night, I kind of talked about it earlier uh, in the day that there was a party of eight or nine people and they all asked for individual checks. And then this one particular lady, uh, I guess they said it was her birthday, so the, those, the, those band members came over and they uh, sang her a happy birthday song. It was real nice. Uh, they proceeded a couple tables over, sang another birthday song, a different version of a birthday song. When the band members went past uh, the eight or nine people table, the lady complained that her song wasn't the same as the others and why. So of course they had to sing the birthday song all over again. To boot, they didn't tip the, uh, the waiters. So total pimpy. I'm convinced people are never happy unless they're complaining or bitching about something. I mean, how much of a low life do you have to be to complain about a song, a birthday song, Saying at another table wasn't as good as this, the version of the birthday song you got. I mean, really. I just picked up uh, a couple shirts tomorrow for my scrimmage at Illinois. I'm working side judge, so I normally am field judge, so I don't have those uh, jerseys. So my buddy Serge was uh, nice enough to let me borrow them for tomorrow. Just doing some editing, the A9 movie, for my uh, next vlog. <laughs> Idiots. We want to go to the baseball game.